Hi guys, it's Melissa, and this is my first video, which is probably going to be extremely obvious. <laughs> Today I just thought I would kind of start out by doing um, a little talk about hair products for curly hair. Um, my hair is naturally like this. Um, it always has been my whole life, so I really had to find a way to like it because for most of my life I really hated it and recently within the past year I discovered a hair care line slash brand that has really changed the hair game for me it's made me enjoy my hair again it's made my hair feel healthier than it ever has been um, which is pretty great since I'm 20 years old and for my entire life I've been trying to find products that didn't make my hair freak out, didn't make it frizzy, didn't dry it out, didn't weigh it down. So that's the brand that I'm going to be talking about that I love and I'm pretty sure it's called, it's pronounced We Dad but I'm not 100% sure because it's spelled O-U-I-D-A-D. So I think it's We Dad, that's how I've heard other people pronounce it. But, uh, and I might be wrong. <laughs> um, you can buy, I know for a fact you can buy um, We Dad products at Ulta and Beauty Brands. Um, they might be at other places, but I know for sure those are the two um, places that I usually find it. I prefer buying it at Ulta because they usually have a lot of really good deals. One time I got a free, so I got the shampoo, conditioner, a shower comb and um, like a turby twist that had weed dot on on it for $25 it's like a gift set in the middle of the summer and usually one bottle of the shampoo or conditioner is $25 so they do some really good surprise stuff and usually you get um, some free gifts at Ulta as well when you buy their products like little mini sizes which actually lasts for a pretty long time so that's why I like to buy it at Ulta. The cool thing about Wee Dot is it's not only just for curly hair, but it's for they have lines of product that are specific to different types of curly hair, which I've never seen a brand do before, but it totally makes sense because like I said, everybody has kind of a different type of curly hair. So the thing about Wee Dot that makes it different from other curly hair hair products is there are four different types of lines slash types of curly hair that they make products for when you go to these places the thing that I love probably the most about this is say you decide that you want to try this brand you don't have to buy full sizes of everything to try it what they do is they have a box that's a trial set for your specific type of hair and it includes the shampoo, the conditioner, and the styling spray that's meant for your hair, as well as some type of styling product that's also meant for your hair. So that's your main like essentials that they consider for your hair. So it's like this size, and this is 2.5 fluid ounces. Um, so for example, this is a curl essential, but this can be used by used by anybody, any type of curl that you have. This is the leave-in conditioner. I think I got this as a free gift, but I've also used the full-size version of this and it's really good. But um, yeah, so you get shampoo, conditioner, usually a spray of some kind and some type of styling product for your specific hair type. When I first tried it, I think it lasted about a month and a half and I wash my hair every other day just so that I don't dry it out. So that's why I think this brand's really great because you don't have to buy the full size products and then you hate them and then you have to return them or you're stuck with them. Um, you can try out the small sizes and see if you like it and it's pretty affordable too, I think, to get four products for $36. Um, so yeah, it's a great way to start out. Um, another great thing about that is like if you do like their products and you're maybe going on vacation, these are travel size, so you can just go pick up a trial box and then 
you've got your main styling products and they're just in the travel size. So that's amazing too. That's another kind of like life hack to this brand. So now I'm going to be talking about what I specifically use and why I like those products. So the products that I use for shampoo and conditioner is of course the tight curls line. So this is what they look like. Um, they are 8.5 fluid ounces and I believe they're $25 each. So it's more of a pricey line, but I think for the fact that the amount of research and science that goes into narrowing down products for a specific type of curly hair is so worth it. And what like the benefits that I've gotten out of this um, hair care line is amazing. My hair has never grown faster in my entire life, I'm pretty sure, because it's so healthy from using this stuff. This stuff truly does moisture my hair like nothing I've ever used before. It just works so well with my hair. So to me, it is worth paying $25 for this amount of product. And it does last a good amount of time. I think I bought these in the middle of the summer. It's now January. And I think I'm about like a little less than half with um, through these bottles. Um, another thing is they on the back of all their products, it's, it has how I use it and then an expert tip. So the expert tip on the shampoo is that you should never scrub or bunch hair together while shampooing. This roughens the cuticle and leads to weaker, frizzier hair. Use fingertips to massage the scalp and gently comb fingers through hair in a downward motion to cleanse and detangle. So I never knew that about shampooing your hair. Honestly, I just always just kind of scrunched my hair up. I didn't know that that caused frizz. So that's pretty nice too is like there's a lot of information on the back of the products that tells you how you should use them and like tips on how to make your hair better. The next thing I use in the tight curls line, this doesn't come in the trial set, um, but I decided just to try it out one time when I ran out of the gel that came in the trial set. So this is the Curl Quencher Hydrofusion Intense Curl Cream. And this is also in the tight curls line. So with this, I always air dry my hair. I can't, um, I can't blow dry my hair even with a diffuser. My hair just goes insane. It gets like frizzy. It turns into a ball. I kind of look like that painter guy, the Bob. Uh, I can't remember his name, last name, but you know who I'm talking about probably. It just is not good. So I just don't. I have given up trying to blow dry my hair. So. I just air dry my hair, it works perfectly fine. It also says the expert tip is it can be used on a classic or tight curl in larger sections to add weight and elongate the curl for a looser beachy wave. I've tried that. I think it does loosen the curl to make it a bigger curl on tight curls, but it's not necessarily a beachy wave. Honestly, I think my curls are too tight for me to ever have like beachy waves unless I had straightened my hair and then like curled it with a curling wand a certain way but I do think if someone with a classic curl hair used this like it says um, that they definitely could achieve a beachy wave look and I do think it works pretty well and it is very hydrating it's not too thick some creams can be way too thick I think this is a great like medium consistency it's not super thin it's not super thick I don't think it leaves very much product buildup in your hair. So I really recommend it. The next thing that I use did come with the trial set and I've purchased this a few times as well because I do think this is really essential to finish off your hair if you have curly hair and I believe this exact spray comes in every single trial set besides the Kinky Curls one because theirs comes with a cream. But this is just the Curl Perfection Finishing Mist. Um, it's just like it says, it's a finishing mist, so after you put all the product in your hair, you will just spray this in and it does a nice hold on your hair. It's not too thick, it's not going to be crunchy, it's just a light hold to kind of keep your products in place and not have a bunch of frizz happening. So I do use this sometimes if I curl my hair with a curling wand, kind of as a hairspray. It's not extreme hold though, so 
you know, your curls might fall out depending on what type of hair you have. Mine usually stay pretty well, so I only really need a medium hold, but they do sell like a more high hold hair, um, hairspray as well, but I've never tried that because this has just worked just fine for me, especially on a day-to-day -day basis, just kind of setting your hair after you put product in it. So I highly recommend this. Um, this comes in like a smaller size, obviously, in the trial set, so I definitely, I've tried to not use this and just use like the products by themselves, but you need this because you just gotta set everything in place or else it's just gonna go everywhere. The Moisture Lock Leave-In Conditioner. And this is just a Curl Essentials line, so any type of curl can use this. Um, I think it's a really nice base for products. I think I bought this in a full size when I first bought the trial box last winter. Yeah, this leave-in conditioner I think is essential for anyone with curly hair because it's going to give your hair tons of moisture. It is a really good base for the products because it kind of does like, I mean it weighs it down a little bit, but it's not going to make your hair flat. It's just going to take care of some of the frizz. It really seals in the, cuti the cuticles of your hair to eliminate frizz. Um, so hydrating. There really is no residue left when you use it. I think this is a fantastic product that anybody can use and it will definitely benefit your hair, especially if you're just starting out. So I would recommend buying a trial set and this in the full size as well. The next product that I use all the time, and I keep getting this as a free gift too, I don't think I've ever had to buy the full size product honestly because I think each time I've bought in anything at Ulta of this brand I've gotten this as a free gift. This is the Climate Control Heat and Humidity Gel. I actually prefer this over the gel that comes in the trial set. They're both really good gels but for me personally frizz is a huge issue especially in the summer because I live in Iowa and it's just so humid that barely anything that would be no frizz would work for me, but this stuff does. Control Heat and Humidity Gel is formulated with wheat protein and elastin polymers that expand and contract with moisture, enveloping cuticles to prevent frizz without altering style. When humidity lessens, the polymers contract, creating natural non-sticky hold. But yeah, I never get frizzy hair with this product, especially in the summer. I just kind of tried it out on a whim because I kept getting these, and so... I decided to try it in place of my old gel and this is amazing. I use it all winter long too because it helps with static. It's just like, I love it. It's amazing. I will always repurchase this. And honestly I really haven't had to because they keep giving it out for free. <laughs> so this is the Wee Dodd Mangango, <laughs> Mangango Oil. It's a multi-use curl treatment that nourishes, smooths frizz, and boosts shine. So as you know, curly hair is really easily dried out, so and it has a little bit more texture than other types of hair, so it's not always going to be looking really shiny and flowy. So oil helps with that, obviously, to restore some shine and give it that smooth look. I think the really great thing about this is there's four different ways they recommend to use it. One is as a conditioner, so you can pour a quarter size amount of treatment into hand and add a drop of water. Work into wet hair and leave on for three to five minutes. Rinse and style as usual. The next way that you can use it is as a leave-in, and that's when you just use fingertips to moisturize scalp and hydrate wet or dry hair, so that's kind of how I use it. And then you can also use it as a heat protectant, which is why I think it's gonna be great to use in the summer. So it says, apply before heat styling to protect and speed drying time without weighing curls down. And like I said, this also prevents or protects against UV rays, so I think this will be great in the summer. You can also use it as a finisher. Warm a few drops between palms, concentrating on ends for frizz control and shine. Perfect for separating tight and kinky curls, and it does do that pretty well. So I do like to add this on my ends of my hair because those tend to get more frayed looking and dried out looking than the rest of my hair. So this is the end of my very first YouTube video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I'm really excited to start posting on YouTube. It's something that I've wanted to do for a very long time, like even since middle school. That was a long time ago, like when YouTube looked the old version of it, if you remember that. I watch YouTube so often, like I don't usually watch TV, 
I only really watch YouTube when I'm relaxing and I just love it so much and I thought it would be really fun to try it out. So yeah, I think I have a lot of like interesting information or fun things that I want to film and mostly I wanted to provide useful information to those of you with curly hair because I know it's overwhelming with all the products that are out there. It's hard to find stuff that works for you. So yeah, if you ever have any questions, just feel free to ask me in the comments or message me or anything. And yeah, so thank you for watching and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more.